Hey everyone, my name's Amber. I'm Sharice. And I'm back with another reaction video. Today we're doing Nightwish. Come cover with me. Yep. Some more Nightwish for everyone. <laughs> yep. Uh, we're switching it up a little bit. I know some fans are going to be uh, disappointed, but we've done a lot of Taria recently, so let's share some floor. Yeah, I mean, we'll eventually, we'll probably do the Taria version, oh, yeah. or the original at some point, so don't you know, we already know people will probably want it, so... Oh, yeah, it's probably on our list already, and we will do it. It's just, you know, hear, you know, a different voice, since we've been doing so much Tadia recently. Yeah, we have. Let's get into this. Let's see. good one yeah i liked it in the beginning it started with troy at the tin whistle looked like yeah i really enjoy how they've gone back and incorporated troy more in like it would have been easy to just ignore him like oh i'm sorry and we're in this song when you know we're with the band when we recorded this so you don't have a part in the song but they took some of the old recordings and have him play it which I think is awesome. Um, yeah, I like it because it gives it that more folky feel that I enjoy. I believe the original had the folkiness. It's just live instead of a backing track. Oh, okay. Uh, well, we'll see. Because I've heard this one before. Uh, not one of the ones I'm overly familiar with, but I have heard this one a few times. Okay. 
Um, I and should have like I didn't pay attention where this was. I had to double check during the video, like because I saw them uh, had a thing with water just passing through the crowd. I was like, "There's no way that's in the states." Oh yeah, no, you'd have to go one... pay for that water. They wouldn't just hand it out. <laughs> that's true. Um, yes. Also, I think this is the first time I've ever seen Empu not fully clean shaven. He's got a little bit of scruff there. I did see. I did notice that. Yeah, I'm enjoying this one. Yeah, and the floor sounds really good. Yeah, this one she's kind of staying more in like her lower to mid range. Yeah. It makes me interested to hear the original version again because it's been a while. Is I know Tati has got a nice low range too, so she does. But I'm guessing Taria probably still was class more classical, while obviously Flora is more contemporary in this. <laughs> uh, what album was that off of? I can't remember. Uh, I have a list here. Hold on. Mm -mm. Where is it on my list? Well, it'd be quick if I just search it. Wishmaster. So yeah, it was probably a little more classical than contemporary. But she didn't really start really getting contemporary until like Century Child at once. If I remember correctly. So it'd be interesting the two different versions would be here, you know, we'll obviously go back and do Tadias eventually. To like see the differences in the versions. Not necessarily say one is better, but just to see what the differences were and Yeah, you know. compare the differences. Which like how each singer decided to put emphasis where and what style to use and how. Yeah, it's always cool to just see what they do differently. Um, but yeah, this is really good. I mean, Floor always sounds amazing and looks great and interacts with the audience. And then I liked when they did have the camera on the audience and they're all like, they were all <laughs> making funny faces and stuff. I'm really into it. Yeah. Well, let's finish this off. Yeah. Sharice, by the way, I don't know if you re realize, this was the tour you saw them on for the first time. This is the Decades tour. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I saw that on the description there, Decades tour. Just, I yeah. remember that because they were handing out the CD. We yeah. So, yeah, that was awesome. Same tour. That was, awesome. that was awesome. I was like dying to be that. <laughs> That was awesome. Uh, concert. But yeah, this one's really good. Yeah, I did like, though, towards the end, though, Floor did have a little bit of a classical mix in there. Yeah, definitely hear more Tarea's version coming through there at the end, for sure. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, got a class. She had a little bit more classical uh, sound in there. But that's a great thing about Floor. She can do all the different vocal styles. Mm -hmm. Tarea can do cl uh, classical and uh, contemporary as well, not to say that you can't. 
Oh yeah, I was I was just saying though, like when she was with Nightwish, she mainly did more mostly classical. Yeah, she had sometimes she did a little contemporary, but mostly classical was her thing. But I was just saying with like Floor now that she's the singer, like she can go back and do like <laughs> mm-hmm. when she wants it, the older stuff, like she can like do kind of a mix, you know, make it her own, which is cool. Yep. So, what are you gonna give this song? Yeah, this was really good. I like this one. Like, it had some good heavy elements in there, but also really pretty, too. Um, and the folky at the beginning. I like this. And I'll give this 8.75. I will agree. 8.75. This was really good. I enjoyed it. And, you know, we're slowly making our way through the whole discography. Slowly. <laughs> so, uh, please share links in the description for the video and all of our social media. And we just want to let you know that both our Patreon and PayPal are now open, so please just send us your requests, and the links will be down in the description. Until next time, bye! Bye!